Alright, what's up guys? It's Fat Boy Tomato here. Bringing you some gameplay of Towerfall Exten- Wow. Towerfall Ascension. Now the game's on the PlayStation Store. For PlayStation Plus members are free now. It's not $15. It's gonna be up for PlayStation Plus. And my air conditioner's making some really weird noise, but not stopped. But anyway. So, right now we're gonna check out the game. I'm gonna- I guess I'm gonna do like a semi, like a small review of how I feel about the game. It's my first time playing it. For all, for those of you that played on PC or have Steam. Hey. Good for you. <laughs> but, actually, when I seen, when it first came out and I seen, like, uh, the gameplay for it, I thought it was a really cool game. But, I think it's a really cool game when you have friends that are willing to play it. Now, most of my friends do not want to play this game. Or would never play this game. I don't know why. I think it's fun. I mean, it's different. I know the graphics like aren't like crazy good, like <clears throat> AAA games. But wow, I died already! Holy smokes! I know it doesn't have graphics like a uh, any AAA title, but I mean, still, like that's fine. I think it's the gameplay that we go for nowadays, right? Depending on the, I guess depending on the person. Because some decide to go for the graphics and the capabilities of the hardware of like the next gen consoles. So, I mean, to me, it's not a big deal. To others, it may be. But, uh, So, I think this is stage one. Now, what I noticed, it looked like, oh, run. Run. Oh, I didn't know. I thought I died if I jumped down there. Um, so, so far, what I've noticed about this game is that, one, it's 8 bit. Maybe even. 8 bit. It's 8 bit. But besides that, there's different rounds in each stage, I'm assuming. So, yeah, when I just uh, killed all the enemies and completed a round, uh, I'm gonna assume that this is story mode and that you have to complete a, new, like, a number of challenges in each stage. Which, I mean, I guess that's okay, but. It feels like it'll take long. So I guess it has like a lot of replay replayability. Oh, I got the two for one. <laughs> I made it rain on them blobs. Um, come on. Jeez, I suck. I really suck at this game. I'm not that good. So now we're on round four, as you can see. And they turned the glitch. That's cool, I guess. I mean, I, I, personally, I like the game. It's different. It's not like your typical, you know, title. It's, it's different. I like that. I like how the mechanics, like, are a little, the controls are a little funky. As far as, like, aiming and then shooting the arrow and stuff. And then I guess if you aim in, like, the general vicinity of, like, the enemy, it'll shoot. But... Them. I think that's a little weird. I don't know. I thought it'd be like a little more like, wow, two times in like five seconds. That's crazy. Yeah, I thought like you'd have like a little more, I guess, verse. I, th <laughs> I figured that'd be a little more versatile. So you can only point straight up and then I believe at an angle, maybe. And then down if you're falling down. But that's about it. You can't like swivel it or anything. So that kind of threw that threw me off because I thought that I'd be able to aim it wherever I wanted. But I thought wrong. So oh, take that to the head, bish, bish. So I'm still trying to figure out the characters. I don't know. If I'm, I feel like I'm using a girl. Like it looks like one, but I don't know. I can't really tell. So that was the end of the first stage. We can move on to the second one. I don't know. I'm looking at my stats right now. Got 18 kills, three deaths, two combos. I don't even know how to do combos. It took me three minutes and 20 seconds. I feel like that's probably the slowest time in history. Because I feel like I probably should have beat that a whole lot faster. But anyway, it's a, it's a typical indie title, and it's like I said, it's different. It's definitely you have to 
you have to have an open mind when you go to play a lot of a lot of indie titles and so like i said as far as like my friends go i wouldn't be able to have like three other friends sit down and like play with me to play this game they're like so gun hole triple a and it kind of sucks you know i wish they would uh not wish but i hope eventually down the line that they put an online mode for titanfall ascension the ps4 version because i mean i have like one or two friends that online that play it but my like immediate friends they would never play this so i believe i think that would be a great addition to this game that's if they want to expand on it or put a patch it depends on obviously the developers to want to take it to that extent but for the most part i think it's a fun game it's different it brings the controls are like a little funky it it brings something new to the consoles you know what i mean and i guess that's what a lot of companies are trying to do maybe not a lot of companies but a lot of indies are trying to go back to our roots like where gaming started and just remake those type of games it's, which is good because a lot of people love like love playing those type of games like 8-bit or just just games from back in the old days so it's your boy falcon xmk i hope you have a fantastic day if you have any questions leave leave them in the comment section and if you really like this video please be sure to smash that like button that'd be so awesome that'd really help me out so all right guys peace out